let's cross over here and uh, get some more information see the decorations upside down have been visiting this upside down house water park in sunny beach uh, people are having fun in there welcome to sunny beach part two vlog starting the day with some fitness training at this outdoor gym let's see what else is there in sunny beach if you are not a subscriber please hit the subscribe button to follow these travel vlogs an evening at Khan stand is one of the top things to do this is a restaurant situated on a hill northern side of the resort you can get here by taxi drive or organized mini bus you get spectacular views of the entire resort from here. There is a variety show, entertainment, or a band every evening. It gives holiday makers a chance to dress up and enjoy some fine dining. I am discovering that there is a lot more to do here in Sunny Beach. There is everything for everyone, and it's not just the nightlife. In Sunny Beach, right at the top here, you can actually walk uh, to the water park from most places in Sunny Beach. This is the Sunny Beach Aqua Park. There is another Aqua Park in Niseba. They offer free shuttle buses to the water park. One day ticket, 52 left. Afternoon ticket, it's cheaper. So you can actually decide to come here in the afternoon and get a cheaper ticket. Uh, seniors also got a reduced price. There are several excursions that you can do from sunny beach to various places either on your own on public transport, taxi or on organized excursions by coach. Shevana is quite a magical village to visit. It has turned into an architectural museum of well-preserved and restored houses and they serve traditional meals the traditional way walking around the entire sunny beach resort it's not only for exercise and fresh air, you can discover some interesting things within the resort. Royal Beach Mall, the Dinosaur Park, for some adventure. looking for the upside down house which is a top attraction here in sunny beach and it says at the top of um, fast food then you turn that way found it the upside down house so there's the entrance look at that the upside down house in Sunny Beach. 
we pay here 11 left to go into the upside down house black area so i just go in okay thank you so we go into the upside down house as well let's go in and have some fun wow look at that wow the upside down house in sunny beach see the roof the roof is just down like that in sunny beach you can see the roof is right down wow and um, doors and windows wow. let's go around it upside down house it's really weird This is going to be fun. Wow. And it says welcome and goodbye. Uh, it's forbidden to enter people with vertigo. So if you've got vertigo, you can't go in there. Let's take a look. Go try it. So we in the house that is upside down, you see, everything is upside down. The stairs and we need to get to the door. Wow. Really interesting visiting this upside down house where everything is upside down. Nisepa, the World Heritage Site, is a short distance from Sunny Beach. It is a must visit. It's too left on the bus, or you can get the mini train, or walk along the beach for more sightseeing. There are taxis as well to Old Niseba. A full tour of Niseba, the World Heritage Site, will be covered in the next video. If you are not a subscriber, make sure you hit the subscribe button so you get notified. We are at the bus stop in Sunny Beach and waiting for a local bus to get to St. Plus and to check it out. I think there is another beach there in St. Plus and a smaller town. We are looking at bus time times to um, listen to St. Plus. Yeah, we are going to St. Plus and these are the times here. Same from Sunny Beach bus station at 11, 11.40. Hopefully we'll get the one at 11.40 looks like it's um, two buses an hour and so they print this out on a day-to-day -day basis they, they haven't got anything electronic so it, it's good that they print this out so that you know when you get we are in St. Plus and we just got off the bus stop, bus stop number 8. Day visit to St. Plus is covered in a separate video if you keep watching the Bulgarian vlog series on this channel. Yeah, I think uh, yeah, that bus is going to Bogus. Yeah. It is very easy to go on a day trip to Bogus on public transport. Bogas, a very beautiful city. This is also where the airport is located, just outside the city center. 
on the bus, you pass through some interesting places too. In Bogas, you get passes to different places in Bulgaria and you also get international departures. A departure board showing some departures local and international. You can get to Fana, Sofia, Istanbul from here. And also get the train station through there. Some highlights of a day trip in Bogas. From a beautiful city centre with shops, restaurants and hotels to a popular stretch of the sea garden for entertainment, relaxation and a perfect coastline. The sea garden is relaxing, it's massive, it's got everything, restaurants, cafes, entertainment and relaxation facilities. Beautiful sea garden runs along the coastline. So you have the sea garden to one side and you have the beach and the coastline to the other side. What a relaxing place to spend the day. Only a short walk from the sea garden to the town center for shops, restaurants, tourist information and more. There is also a huge indoor shopping complex It is easy to connect to Sosopo from Bogas by bus and back to Sunny Beach. Why not check out this Sosopo day trip video on this channel if you haven't already watched it. There are other places even closer to Sunny Beach on the same bus such as uh, to the uh, Salt Lakes. Back in Sunny Beach Main Resort, there is still plenty to do. You can easily spend um, two weeks or longer here. You can get around on this mini train, walk from one end to the other, and there are buses that can take you to other places nearby. So really enjoyed uh, breakfast here at this cafe. I went to try this cafe restaurant bar. It's at the top of Sunny Beach from Flower Street. You cross the main road and walk towards the top of Sunny Beach. I think it's the southern side. And I've seen it uh, on YouTube, recommended by the regular Sunny Beach Life YouTubers. Breakfast is served, so we got toasts and we got the full English in Bulgaria. Good breakfast at this place. We had full English, which is a toast, egg, bacon, hash brown, sausage, baked beans, and a cup of coffee. Very pleasant hospitality from this cafe, restaurant and bar owners. I think their husband and wife. I highly recommend this place if you are in Sunny Beach. I follow the Sunny Beach Life YouTubers. Was hoping to meet them here and she is showing me the meet up poster outside their restaurant. They aren't here today. Sunny Beach Life YouTubers, please give us a shout out. I am your subscriber as well. I hope you have enjoyed this video so far. Let's look at a few more things to do around here.